I did make every effort to include the latest scientific studies. Please note, though, that research is constantly changing, and one clinical trial cannot always cover diverse bodies and communities. Individual responses to food, supplements, treatments, and skincare products may vary based on genetics, environment, and other factors. Relying on a single doctor can be risky as errors and biases can occur. Listen to as many medical experts and natural medicine clinicians as possible. My sources and references are posted in the description box below. Horny goatweed, scientific name Epimedium, is an herb that has been used in traditional Chinese medicine for centuries. It is often marketed as a natural remedy for various health issues, including erectile dysfunction and low libido. One of the primary mechanisms by which horny goatweed is believed to potentially benefit sexual function is through its effects on blood flow. It contains a compound called icarian, which is thought to have vasodilatory properties. Vasodilation refers to the widening of blood vessels, which can increase blood flow to various parts of the body, including the penis. Increased blood flow to the penis is a crucial aspect of achieving and maintaining an erection. By enhancing blood flow, horny goatweed may theoretically help improve erectile function in some individuals. In an oldie study exploring the therapeutic effects of horny goatweed on patients undergoing hemodialysis, researchers observed not only an improvement in sexual function, but also an increase in interleukin-2 activity of peripheral blood monocytes, which are a type of white blood cell involved in immune defense. This suggests that horny goatweed may have immuno-enhancing effects in addition to its potential benefits for sexual health. By the way, before I continue, if you're new here, I'm Jara from the Philippines. Welcome to my channel where I share my knowledge and discoveries gained from reading scientific journals and books written by doctors and natural medicine clinicians. I have a strong interest in subjects related to health and wellness, especially natural remedies, personal development, dogs, and cats. Some of my favorite books are Dissolving Illusions, Disease, Vaccines, and the Forgotten History by Dr. Susan Humphreys and Roman Bistrianic. Vitamin C, The Real Story, The Remarkable and Controversial Story of Vitamin C by Dr. Steve Hickey and Dr. Andrew Saul. And Atomic Habits by James Clear. If you're also a pet lover, somewhat health conscious and have an insatiable thirst for new knowledge, I invite you to consider subscribing. Also, after watching this presentation, you might want to check out 12 health benefits of alpha lipoic acid backed by human studies and 18 health benefits of NAC and acetylcysteine backed by human studies. The links are in the description box below. Moving on, another study focused on the efficacy and safety of Capra, a traditional herbal medicine containing horny goat weed in treating mild to moderate erectile dysfunction in Thai patients. The study found that Capra led to improvements in erectile function as assessed by the International Index of Erectile Function Questionnaire. The mean change in the score from baseline for the erectile function domain was significantly higher in the Capra group compared to the placebo group. The most common adverse events were dizziness, face numbness, and abnormally rapid heart rate. Furthermore, a randomized controlled trial published in 2014 found that a non-prescription health-promoting medication in Japan containing aged garlic extract, ginseng, oriental bezoar, velvet antler, cuscuta seed, and horny goat weed effectively improved erectile dysfunction, along with other aging symptoms. It's also a small study, though, with only 49 elderly men participants. The presence of other herbs in the medications in the last two studies mentioned makes it challenging to isolate the specific effects of horny goat weed. Since they contain a combination of multiple herbs, it's difficult to attribute any observed benefits solely to horny goat weed. The efficacy of horny goat weed may be influenced by interactions with other herbs or synergistic effects with the herbal blend, making it challenging to assess its individual contribution to the outcomes observed in the studies. Therefore, while the studies provide valuable insights into the overall effectiveness of the medications in improving sexual health, they may not conclusively demonstrate the isolated efficacy of horny goat weed itself. This limitation underscores the need for further research, including well-designed studies focusing specifically on horny goat weed to better understand its therapeutic potential and mechanisms of action in treating erectile dysfunction and improving blood flow to the penis.